everyone in this video we are going to make a matlab program and the problem that we are looking is this it's basically a watermarking scheme and the scheme is of this type uh, where c is a function of lambda 1 times exponential to the power minus lambda u when u is greater than 0 and the scheme basically is c, c0 equals c0 plus alpha times mk where m is the message and k is the key that we are using to embed and the question that we're going to work on is this where we got to plot the probability of error versus the noise power and we can use lambda 1 equals 100 and lambda 2 equals 1 to 10 uh, you can modify this according to your own needs okay so as specified in the question we have lambda 1 equal to 100 lambda 2 equal to 1 to 10 alpha is basically set to 1 we are uh, using n equals to 8 cross 8 you can use 64 plus 64 if you want uh, then we are using the variance we calculate as 1 by lambda 1 times square and the mean is 1 by lambda 1 and variance of k which is the key is basically 1 and then we run a loop from 1 to lambda 1 lambda 2 and we calculate the variance of noise and the mean of noise uh, you can see variance of noise is basically 1 by lambda 2 times square mean of noise is minus 1 by lambda 2 and then we calculate a new function a new variable sigma which is basically 1 by n times variance of c plus mean squared plus variance of n plus uh, mean of noise squared plus 2 times of variance of c variance of uh, oh my bad this is basically uh, this is actually uh, the mean of c mean of n times the variance of the key okay and then we calculate probability of error that is basically half times error function alpha plus the threshold threshold we have taken zero in this case you can verify the uh, vary this according to your needs divided by the square root of two times this variable that we just calculate and for the y, for the x-axis we basically have sigma n plus mu n square which is basically uh, variance of noise plus mean of noise squared this gives us the uh, the power of the noise and then we all all we got to do is plot probability of bit error which is this and against this so let me just run it over here okay so this is the type of graph that it gives us uh, 0 to 2 is the x scale 0 to 7 times 10 to the power minus 9 is the y scale and you see, as you can see it's plotting the function over here perfectly if you have any queries you can ask in the comment section i'm putting the code in the description